Okay. Hello, Liz. How are you? Can you hear me? Fine. Yes, I hear you. Okay, very <laughs> good. How are you today? Um, I'm fine. <laughs> fine. Okay. Coming back, yes. from, coming back from work? No, now is um, I am in the in, in the work in my job. Already, wow! Yes. What time? I finish. I finish my job at ten p.m. Okay, good. So it's gonna yes. be kind of late. Okay, yes. when we finish the class, then you go home. Yes. Okay. <laughs> All right. Yes. Okay, that's good. Excellent. Yesterday, I have problems to hear you the class. Okay. Uh huh. But now I can hear you very well. Okay, good. Just just let me know right in the in the WhatsApp uh, chat, you know, in the group. If you have any okay. problems, you know, let me know so that I can see how we can fix it. Right? Okay. Thank you. Okay. Thank very good. Uh, Vanessa, are you there? Yes. Okay. Thank you. All right. Good. No problem. Can you hear me very well? Yes. Okay. Good. Perfect. How about you, Kevin? Oh, Kevin's here. Hi, Kevin. Mm -hmm. uh, he's still fixing the, the audio, maybe. Okay, good. Now we have Ronnie, Moises, okay, Jorge Alberto, and Eddie is coming in. Okay, good. Okay, ready, Kevin? Yes. I don't hear you. Yes, you got, you got an issue there, Kevin. Fix it. Okay, good. And Ronnie. How are you? Good. How are you today? I'm fine. Okay, great. Ready? Yes. Okay, that's all right. Okay, good. Okay, William. William is here too. Jorge Alberto. Okay, fine. Good evening. Hey, good evening, guys. Okay, let's get it started. Okay, did you do the the knowledge check? Yes. Okay. Don't, oh. don't don't forget to do those exercises, right? Because you know that's your your grade, you know, to to be promoted to the next level. Okay, in the following month. Okay, so those are your grades. Now remember that if you have questions or something, uh, you can let me know early in the morning or afternoon so that I can help you because I just I just saw uh, uh, somebody asking, but in this moment, you know, it's more difficult to to help through the WhatsApp. But if you let me know before, then I will find a way to do it. Okay. Good. Okay. So don't forget the. Okay. The evaluations, right? Because those are your grades. Okay. And then we can see also if you are uh, taking advantage of the of the lesson. If the, there is no problem with the topics, then that's the way that I can find out how you are doing. Okay. Then uh, today we have a another topic, but before. Okay. Okay, just a uh, eh, recuerden lo que les dije ahora en el, en el grupo, ¿verdad? De tener un poquito de cuidado con el sonido ambiente alrededor de nosotros para que que no tengamos mucha interferencia, ¿ok? Good. Okay. Then, uh, okay, so this is the, the objective that we have for today, but before.
Okay. So remember yesterday we had uh, the, the conjunction. Conjunctions. Conjunctions, right? Conjunction. And, uh, and but, so, and, however. 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 Okay, good. And then we said that we use uh, this, uh, these conjunctions, these words, to connect sentences, right? Or ideas. Okay? So we have N have to connect to positive ideas. Sometimes we have but when you have a, an idea in a contrast to that idea, something that probably is going to be affirmative and negative, okay? Or vice versa. Then you have though and however that we use them at the end of a sentence and the meaning is similar to but, okay? But and we use them at the end to make emphasis. Okay? Okay. Okay, good. Then, then we listen, we watched the video. And then, we have the knowledge check. Okay, and this is what we have for today. Okay, Ronnie, can you do my favor and read this um, objective that we have for today? Objective. Okay. In this session, modal verbs can and should be introduced in a conversation. Okay, so we have the modal verbs. Okay, the modal auxiliary verb can and should. Okay, what is the, what is can, uh, please? Can is uh -huh. And then, uh, for example, and then we use it to express what? And an example? Uh-huh. Um, I can drive. I can drive, okay? So that is an ability, right? Mm -hmm. An ability that Liz has. Did you see the 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 uh, document I sent through the WhatsApp when it says permission, ability, okay? So then in this case, when Liz says, I can drive, it means that she has the ability to drive. I can okay. speak, okay? I can speak mm -hmm. is I have the ability to speak. Okay, good. Mm -hmm. And you also have should, okay? What about should? You should. Uh -huh. mm. You should uh, make the homework. <laughs> you should grade the homework, right? That is a mm -hmm. suggestion. Suggestion. Uh -huh. It's a suggestion, right? You should study more. Okay? Mm -hmm. You should practice more English. Okay? These are suggestions, no orders. Okay? No commands. It's different if I say, okay, everybody, study English. Okay? Sounds like an order, right? Study English. But if I, if I say you should, you should study English, then that is a suggestion. Suggestion, okay. okay. Like, like an advice, okay. If you want to learn more vocabulary, you should read you should books read. in English. You should read books in English, okay? Good. Okay. Fine. Okay, this is a brief introduction, and then after you will see the other uh, the video, right? Video. Here we go. Really? Mm -hmm. Okay, here we go. Testing sound. Can you hear? Can you listen? No. Little bit. No teacher. <laughs> Which have been introduced in this I, I want you to listen to this conversation. Hey, Hi, I want you to listen to this conversation. Yes. Yes. Now? 
Yes. Yes. Okay, good. I'm going to start over again. Here we go. Hi, I want you to listen to this conversation and try to identify the modal verbs which are being introduced in this audio program. Also, it is recommended for you to practice this conversation with someone else. Can you tell me a little about Mexico City? Sure, I can. What was that? Well, what's a good time to visit? I think you can go anytime. The weather is always nice. Oh, good. And what should I see there? Well, you should definitely visit the National Museum and go to the Palace of Fine Arts. And what else? Oh, you shouldn't miss the Pyramid of the Sun. It's very interesting. It all sounds really exciting. Okay, were you, were you able to listen? Yes, did you hear very well? Yes? Yes. Okay, good. Now listen again. Just the conversation. Program. Also, it is recommended for you to be to practice this conversation with someone else. Now listen again. Can you tell me a little about Mexico City? Okay, that is the first phrase, right? You have this, uh, this image in your WhatsApp, right? In case you cannot read it very well here. Okay, I sent you this in the, in the group. Okay, okay. Can you tell me a little about Mexico City, right? This is, if you can give me some information, right? Sure, I can. What would you like to know? I say, sure, I can. Okay. What would you like to know? No. What information do you want about Mexico? Well, what's a good time to visit? Well, what is a good time to visit, okay? What is a good time to visit Mexico? Do you know? Mm. Anybody know? Summer. Ronnie? What? What is a good time to visit? I'm sorry, I, I find that pictures in my WhatsApp that make it hairy. Well, could you repeat the, the question, please? What is a good time to visit Mexico? <coughs> in your opinion, right? So, um, summer. Summer, okay. Summer. Um, probably this maybe, month. Uh, um, probably one year. <laughs> no, probably, probably no. The, the good time to visit Mexico can be January, February, March, April. Uh, because of the, the climate, the weather. I don't know. Um, I don't know. William said. Uh, summer, right? Summer. Yeah. It's, what do you think? In Easter. Liz? Yeah. When do you think it's a good time to go, Liz? In my opinion? Uh -huh, in your opinion, of course. Um, I think it's the better, the best weather is um, in summer. Mm -hmm. and maybe in March. Okay, all right. Mm -hmm. Okay, now listen to the guy's opinion, right? I think it's time. The weather is always nice. Okay, I think you can go anytime. Okay. The weather is always, always nice. Nice. Okay. Oh, good. And what should I see there? Okay. What should I see there? The man is asking for a suggestion. What should I see there? Pay attention to those questions, the structure, right? The organization. What should I see there? What should I do? Okay, if I want to lose weight because I am too fat, what should I do? Okay, what should I do? You should eat less. Okay, you should go to
to the nutritionist. Okay? You, <laughs> you should, should make exercise. Ah, uh -huh, yes, you should do exercise. You should run every day. Okay? Yeah. Good. Mm -hmm. Then. Well, you should definitely visit the National Museum and go to the... Okay, this is one of the recommendations. You should definitely, definitely, okay, visit the National Museum and go, and go to the Palace of Fine Art. Okay, if you come to San Salvador, if I go to downtown, what should I see there? What should I see there? The National Palace. Uh -huh, you should go to the you National should, Palace. You should go. Uh, historic Center. You should go to? The History Center. Center. Okay, yes. You it's, should it's go down, to the cathedral. Is downtown history. Uh -huh, the, okay, the, his, the historical downtown. Yes. Okay, very good. Now listen. What else? Oh. And go to Paseo del Carmen. Okay, what else? What more? What other place? What else? Oh, you shouldn't miss the pyramid of, of the sun, right? It's very yes. It's very of the easy. sun. Okay, the pyramid of the sun. And the last one? It all sounds really exciting. It all sounds really exciting. Okay, questions about vocabulary. Anybody? Okay. Okay, good. Then, okay. Any other questions about pronunciation? Museum. 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 Definitely. 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 Okay, good. Okay, now we're going to. Wait a minute, we have. Okay, since you have the, the conversation, we're going to make some groups so that you can uh, practice, right? Hey, wait a minute here. Now that I have you all. Okay, here. So we have 15, uh, let's see. We're gonna have groups of three, okay? So we're gonna have five. Okay, here we go, okay. There will be three participants per session, right? So that you can uh, read the conversation, okay, that you have, and then I will visit your uh, your groups and see how you're doing with the pronunciation. All right, so here we go. Okay, okay. all right. Okay, now you just have to accept your invitations. Okay, good. Eddie, Gio. Eddie, you're missing Eddie. Evelyn, okay, good. Rocio, and Ronnie. Okay, Rocio, you're the only one outside.
Uh, can you tell me a little about Mexico City? Sorry? Sorry, sir. Can you tell me a little about Mexico City? Mm, Mexico City is a beautiful country. Uh, I love uh, Mexican food. Eddie. Uh, Eddie. Yes, yes. Do you have the conversation in your telephone, in your WhatsApp group? Yes. Okay, that's the conversation. That, oh, you're, you're, uh, have, like, you have to practice first, okay? Okay. After okay. You can use your own vocabulary. All right? But you the, were conversation, the conversation that uh, is the platform. Uh -huh. No, I, guess, no. Ah, I don't, I don't, I don't have, I don't have a, a, this conversation. Sorry. Ah, okay, good. But can you see the, can you see my screen? Oh, 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 you, uh, can you can see you this see? one? In the WhatsApp. Uh -huh. yes. yes, you will find uh, it there. Let me see, let me see. Yes, in the WhatsApp group. Later in the afternoon, I sent you the, an image. This one, right? It's there. It's the, la it's the last picture. It's the last image. Thank yes, you. yes. Uh, 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 I have the, the conversation right now. Okay, good. Okay. Go ahead. Practice. You can mm -hmm. use your own vocabulary. Okay. okay. Good. Okay. Okay. Nice. Thanks, teacher. Thanks, teacher. Uh, start. Uh, start. Uh, okay. Mm. Can you tell me a little about Mexico City? Uh, sure, I can. Uh, what would you like to know? Well, that's a good time to visit. I think you can go anytime. The weather is always nice. Oh, good. And what should I see there? Well, uh, should, uh, you should def we finally visit the National Museum and go to the Palace of Fine Arts. And what else? Uh, oh, you shouldn't uh, miss the pyramid of the sun. It is very in inter interesting. It all sounds really exciting. Nice. Hi. Hello. Hi. Can you hear me? Yes, yes, I hear you. Yeah, you, you just came in. Hi. Excuse yeah. me. You just entered the the class. Yes. Ah, okay, yes, because I, I put the other people in the in a group, okay? Uh -uh. The others are, are working on uh, are working in the in the in a group, practicing a conversation that I sent in the in the WhatsApp. Rocio, can you hear me? Rocio? Are you there? Okay, I will send you to a group, uh, this group, okay? Okay, you will get an invitation. I'm pretty hot. Le puse el punto. Ah, oh, qué raro. Sí, solamente esas dos me las tiro como malas. De ahí las demás, sí, me las tiro como buenas. Shopping is great. Hello. But you... Hello. Hello. How are you? Good. Hello. <laughs> Hi, teacher. Okay. Did you practice the conversation? Hi, teacher. 
Okay, did you practice the conversation that you have in the WhatsApp group? The one about Mexico? Okay, this one. Esa era la conversación, Roxana. Okay, you have to practice this one, okay, with the pronunciation and pay attention to the interrogative okay. forms and the affirmative forms, right? Because after that, we're going to practice with that. Okay. Okay. Okay, okay. 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 Roxana, eh, si quieres, yo empiezo y tú eres Elena en la conversación. Okay, perfecto. Okay, can okay. you tell me? Sí, es... Rocío, can you hear me? Rocío. Yes, definitely. 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 That's right. Good. Good pronunciation. Definitely. Okay, any questions? Any problems? Yes, mm -hmm. with the the word shouldn't. 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 Uh -huh. shouldn't. 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 Como conté al final. Shouldn't. Yes, but shouldn't. I exaggerate for you to listen, but you don't have to. Shouldn't. Shouldn't. Okay, Chamara, only you? Um, no, I don't have one. When. Shouldn't. La palabra shouldn't. Shouldn't. Okay, good. Marcela? Shouldn't. Okay, that's good. Vanessa? Shouldn't. Shouldn't. Okay, very good. Okay. Any other question? Definitely? No problem. Definitely. Definitely. <laughs> <laughs> Pay attention to the question. Why should you do? Because that's what we're going to practice after, right? And the affirmative and negative forms, okay? Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. All right? Okay. Okay, good. And Thank how you. Say pyramid. Oh, pyramid. 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 Definitely. Definitely. Okay. Okay. Change your role and game. I, okay. I, I, okay. I answer. I answer. So, uh, sobre the homework, you do the homework, the, um, the conjunction. You know, the, uh huh. El que era de en, but, en, thought, and however. Uh huh. What's the question? Uh, you put the old sentence or only put en, mm -hmm. however, but. Or en. Or en. Mm -hmm. No. ¿Cómo, en. ¿cómo lo hicieron? No, the, the examples that I gave you yesterday was just for but and en. Uh huh. Some of mm -hmm. them with whoever and but those examples are extra from the ones that you have in the platform. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. And with this conversation yeah. today, do you have any questions with vocabulary or pronunciation? Yes, yeah. I have to I have to work uh, with a little problem. Okay, so <laughs> uh, definitely, definitely. Okay, Def definitely. 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 
Definitely. Definitely. Definitely. Definitely. Definitely. Definitely. Okay, Yesenia, repeating. Definitely. Okay, good. Moises? Definitely. Okay. Uh, Jorge? Definitely. 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 Okay, relax, right? Definitely. 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 Okay. Relax. Definitely. Don't force it, right? Definitely. 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 There you go. Definitely. Okay, not please, mm -hmm. right? Not definitely. 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 Okay, very good. Okay. And the last one is, is pyramid. Which one? Pyramid. 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 Definitely. 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 Okay. Okay. Okay, very good. Okay, see you later then. Just let me okay, be there. See you later. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Um what would and what I should do in this place? In that place. So. In that place, you can rest in, and and you can you can pass relaxed moment with your family. Can I? It's very nice. It's very nice. Can I go with my girlfriend? Yes. Sure, <laughs> <laughs> sure. It's, sure. it's a safe. It's a safe place. It's safe place. <laughs> What, yes. what is the place? The Park. Cuscatlan Park. The Cuscatlan Park. Ah, the Cuscatlan Park. Well, now yeah. they say it's a it's a safe place. Now they say I'm yes. I'm mm. Yes. Okay. Yes. It looks nice, right? It looks nice. Okay. Okay. It, good. It's about San Salvador City in our conversation. Okay, you're talking about you, you use San Salvador. It's okay. Good. It's yes. better. You, know, you have yes. Yes. Yeah. Next. the original vocabulary. Okay, any yeah. questions about the, the pronunciation or vocabulary from the conversation? Uh, pronunciation. Uh -huh. no any, any more? Uh, you just, you, okay. Go Which ahead. One, no, go ahead. Okay. okay. No, Ronnie. Ronnie. Okay. Uh, you say that I sit there is the same I do there. Should? Oh, yes, I do. Mm. Well, why should I do? Uh -huh. Why should I see there is the same? Uh, no, not exactly. Because uh, if if you go to if you go downtown, if I say if I go downtown, the historical uh, downtown, what should I see there? Mm. Well, you should see the national palace. Okay, you should see the cathedral. Okay, but what should I do there? What should I? Do? Uh -huh. uh -huh. Okay, if you go to the cathedral, you should listen to the mass, to the priest, right? Mm -hmm. That's an action. Okay. Okay, if you go to, oh, okay. uh, uh, to the National Palace, what should I do there? Well, you should, uh, you should ask a guide to tell you about the history of El Salvador. Okay, and then oh, okay. listen to the history of El Salvador. That's the action. Okay, what I'm else should I see guy. here? Ah, you should see the National Theater. Okay, the National Theater, right? Teatro Nacional, good. And what should I do there? Eh, you should uh, see a play, right? Una obra, right? You should see a play, you should listen to a concert. Okay, do is an action, okay. and see is only, you know, what you can go and see with your eyes. Okay? Okay. Okay, okay good. Well, see you later okay. with the other groups. See you. Teacher. Yes, sir. I, I have a question. Uh -huh. Tell me. Uh, what, is, what is the difference between should and would? Should? Should and, and would. A uh, would. And would. would. Okay, yeah. would. Uh, should, remember that is for a suggestion, okay? Advice, okay, that you can ask to somebody. And would is something that it could happen, okay? For example, uh, something that you probably wish 
something that you want to happen. For example, I would like to be rich. Okay, but I am not rich, right? I would like to drink a Coca-Cola in this moment. Okay, but I don't have a Coke. Okay, I only have water. Yes, but I say, for example, yes. but if I tell you, okay, uh, after this class, you should rest. It's my recommendation. Okay. When you, you go to the doctor, doctor, when you go to the doctor, the doctor say, you should take vitamins. You should do exercise. These are the recommendations of the doctor. Okay. okay. Then, for example, if it's, uh, but if I don't have money to go to the doctor, they say I would like to have money to pay the doctor. Okay. You got? It? Yeah. Okay. Remember yeah. that would is like ia, right? Gustaría. I would like. Okay. I would go. I would like. For example, I would go to Miami every month but I don't have money, okay? <laughs> I would go if I had money, but I don't, all right? Okay, good. Good, is, good is for myself. No, in general. Is, no, uh, okay. I mean, in general, for example, my sister would like uh, uh, to visit the uh, okay. 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 My sister should learn English, okay? Mm -hmm. So now you can use them for all of them, okay? Now we're going to show you some uh, exercise, uh, some uh, examples that I have on the platform so that you can also read more. Okay, good. Okay. okay. All right. Now here we go back okay. to the Thank you, teacher. to the main station. Okay, you're welcome. Okay. Hello. 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 Hola, hola. Hello. Everybody's back? Yes. Yeah. Okay, good. Okay, I guess, uh, well, everybody was in the groups, right? So there were like one at the end who, was, who came in late after. Is anyone there? Okay, now let me show you the other example. Okay, this also you have it in the WhatsApp group, but we can see it here. Okay. okay. These are other examples, right? For example, we have a, remember I told I told in one of the groups that should can be used for I, you, he, she, it, we, you, they. All no the pronouns, okay? No problem, okay? Mm -hmm. Pay attention, pay attention to this. Sarah is I, he, she, it, or what? Is she, she. Okay. She. she should go. See that we don't think, for example, she should go. Right? You say she go to the doctor, she looks sick. Now here she says she looks. Looks. You're not using the modal auxiliary. Okay? Okay. Continue. Sarah should go to the doctor, she looks sick. That's my opinion. Okay? Look, okay. you should go to the cinema and see the new Spielberg film. That's my recommendation. Okay. Uh, you should uh, go to the new pizza restaurant on the corner. The pizza is cheap and delicious. Is my recommendation. Okay. Good. Number three. When you go to Chiapas, you should bring happy, right? The drink. Pochito <laughs> with rice. Okay, that is a suggestion, right? Obviously, if you go to Mexico, the first thing that you should do is you should eat in the streets. Okay? okay? Like if you eat pupusas, right? If you go to a restaurant here in Salvador to eat pupusas, is it a good recommendation? Yes. yes. It's That's a good recommendation. Uh, 
The chorus. The chorus. Okay, good. Question. Look at the. These are affirmative. The number one is affirmative. The number two is affirmative. Uh, number three is uh, not another question. Uh, no, it's affirmative too. Affirmative. And the number four is a question. Do you think? Okay, the question is here. Do you think? Do you think? I should buy this school bag? School bag. Do you think Advice. I should speak faster? Okay. Then we have number five, a negative sentence. Maria, shouldn't eat too much. Eat too much. You're getting fat. You're getting fat. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, Maria, so you're good, right? No? Well, no. <laughs> Give me an example, right? No offense. No offense, okay? So I'm gonna use my name, okay? Luis, you see too much for getting fat. Okay? okay. Then the number six. I don't think it is a good idea. You should buy okay? that hat. I don't think it is a good idea you should buy the latest iPhone. It's too expensive. Okay? But if you have the money, no problem. <laughs> Negative. One thousand. Yeah, dollars is, is nothing, right? Nowadays. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Rances shouldn't watch too much TV. Okay, Rances shouldn't. Rances. Negative. Rances shouldn't watch TV. Okay. It's a name. A recommendation. Okay, if you see here, next to each sentence, you will find what you want. Number one, expressing opinion. Number two, recommendation. In the number four, you are asking for advice. Do you think? Do you think I should get married? Mm. Well, I am married. Who's <laughs> <laughs> uh, asking for advice? Then Maria, you shouldn't eat is also an advice. It's a good idea. You should buy an opinion. This is my opinion, but it's your decision. Okay, and the last one, you shouldn't watch too much TV, recommendation. Okay, or you should watch TV in okay? For example, I can recommend, right? You should watch more TV in English. Okay, so it's a recommendation. The opposite, in Okay? Then, the other one is affirmative sentences. Okay, Ronnie, can you read the first one? Okay. okay. Affirmative sentences. One. If you want to learn another language, you should learn some strategies. Some strategies. Right. Strategies. If you want to learn strategies. another language, you should learn some strategies. 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 What are some strategies? For example, now listen to music in English all the time. And watch the videos in English. Uh -huh. If you have an agenda for everyday activity, write in English. Read a book. Tomorrow, what do you have to go to tomorrow? Go to the bank. Uh, start uh, pay, pay the electricity bill, uh, fill in the tank with gas, put the sentences in English in your agenda, right? Okay. Then uh, send a present to the teacher. Okay. Then everything in the agenda in English, okay? Yeah. Okay. Now, Liz, can you read the second one? Yes. Uh, you look so tired. You should, you should get more sleep. Thank you. I will. Okay. Then, Eddie, you read number three. Number three? Yes. Okay. Uh, Mariela works so hard. She should take a vacation. Perfect. Thank you very much. Okay. Um, we have some 
So more, uh, Xiomara, in the negative center, number one. Rodrigo should, shouldn't okay. smoke so much. He has a terrible cold. Cough. 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 shouldn't smoke so much. Okay, he has a terrible cough. Oh. Okay. Moses, Moses, number two. Number two, okay. Uh, you shouldn't drink too much coffee before you go to bed. Excellent, okay, you shouldn't drink, you see? Otherwise you won't be able to sleep well. Laura, number two, number three. Some doctor says that we shouldn't eat meat. It is bad for our health. Our health. Our. Health. Uh -huh. Health. Our health. Sounds with the C. Health. 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 Yes, remember that only health. 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 Yes. <laughs> say that we shouldn't eat meat. That is bad for. Okay. Good. Negative sentences. Okay. Sure. Sure. Susan rent a car for her next trip on to London. Traveling by plane is more expensive. Okay. Good. Should Susan, this is a question. Should Susan rent a car for her next trip to London? Okay. For example, should you, uh, should, for example, let's see, uh, should Xiomara rent a car to go to work tomorrow? <laughs> Xiomara, be fast. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> should Xiomara rent a car? No. <laughs> <laughs> we drive too fast, then. <laughs> yes, we're trying to save. Okay, then we say yes, okay, because it's too dangerous, right? Okay. okay let me see who, who hasn't read. Who's missing? I don't see the whole list okay, now. I can't. Okay, here. Okay, Kevin. Number two. Hello. Questions. Okay. What do you think? Should I rest for a moment? I feel tired. Okay. See the questions, right? What do you think? Opinion. Should I rest for a moment? Okay. What do you think? Uh, should we extend the class until 11 o'clock? Yes. Oh, yes. <laughs> yes. One more hour? No problem? Yes. Mm. <laughs> no. <laughs> then you say, no, I feel tired, you would say, right? I feel mm -hmm. tired. Okay, good. Now, Jesenia, how about number three? Question number three. I don't feel good today. What should I take? Okay. See, for example, this question, right? Do you remember that you can use uh, something that you just change some word and you can use these questions in any context? For example, um, I have a headache. What should I take? Okay. A, I, for example, I need to, I need to buy, I need to fix my car. Where should I take it? Okay. If you, if you can recommend a mechanic, right? For example, I don't, uh, a, it's cold here. Okay, it's cold here. What should I wear? What should I do? Okay, you should wear a jacket. You should wear a cap. All right? You should. Uh huh. Okay, any opinions? Any questions? No, oh, it's clear. Okay, good. No. All right. Okay, so here we have, and then uh, the last one that we have Ken, right? Uh, in which situations? Teacher, teacher, yes. I have a question. Uh, the shoe is the similar cool. 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 Uh -huh. No. Cool, remember. Cool, cool is, is the interrogative. Wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. 
Cool and the C O U O U. Uh -huh, okay, no. L V. Could is the past tense of can. Could uh, okay. is the past tense of can, right? Okay. And it has okay. many different uses, right? For example, could sometimes could be like a similar. It's a similar to should, but in a different way. For example, when you mm -hmm. say, uh, "I could buy a car," but then you say, "For example," but you don't say, "I should buy a car." You see, the meaning is different. I could buy a car mm -hmm. means that I have the money, but I don't want to buy it. Okay. Mm -hmm. You okay. Say, I could buy a car. Podría comprarlo, right? Mm -hmm. But I want. But if I say, for example, I should buy a car. Uh -huh. But I need the the, the buy the, the car. Exactly right. I, but, uh -huh. If I have to go to I don't know to San Vicente every day, and that is a very long trip, they say, well, you should buy a car, right? Mm -hmm. and, mm -hmm. and, okay, okay. And then I say, I would, I would buy a car if I could pay for the car. I can. You see how you're using would, okay. would, so different meaning, right? Okay, okay, okay. Good. Thanks. Now, then you see, for example, also the word can. <coughs> can, this is where we, when we begin the class, when we began the class, uh, you were talking about ability, right? And then Liz, I guess you said, I can drive a car, right? And then, so that's an ability. I can speak English, I can read, um, I, can, uh, I can use a computer. So those are skills, abilities, okay? If you see the next one, ask for permission is, can I borrow your pen, please? Right, the same can, but in a different situation, okay? Can I can I ask you a question? Okay, for example, you see, Roberto, can I ask you a personal question? Is asking for permission. Okay. Okay. Or, or can you lend me can you lend me one dollar or can you lend me five dollar, please? Exactly. Okay. Can you lend me some money? Can you lend me a dollar? <laughs> okay. One dollar never I comes can. back. But anyways. <laughs> okay. uh, which is the difference entre borrow and lend? Lend me. Okay, borrow is when you take, and lend is when you give. Yes. Okay. For example, okay. say, suppose that uh, you are in front of me, okay, and mm -hmm. and your cell phone and your phone is in front in, in on the on the on the table, and then I say, can I borrow your uh, your cell phone, please? Please, can I take? Mm -hmm. Borrow is take, okay? Mm -hmm. And if I say, can you lend me your cell phone is, can you give me? You give me the cell phone. Obviously, in the two words, is only prestado, right? Borrow and lend, I have to return it, okay? Mm -hmm. But okay. borrow okay. is I take, and lend is you give me. Is that clear? Okay. Yes? Okay. Yes, thanks. All right, good. Then, remember, that's for permission, right? Then you also have to request something, like a favor, right? Can you help me, please? Uh, can you get me a glass of water, please? Okay, so these are, you know, for example, something that, some things that we uh, request that we ask other people to do for us. Can you give me a ride to my job? Can you give me a ride to my house? <laughs> All right. No problem. Possibility. It can get very cold there at night. Okay. For example, now the what is the name of the coronavirus, right? Trump. Okay. The coronavirus can get to El Salvador. It's a possibility, right? Uh, some people, some people can die with this virus. It's a possibility, okay? So then you say use can for possibilities too. Okay, the other one is, can I carry your bags for you? Because you offer help, okay? 
can I, uh, for example, can I give you a, a ride? This is you offer. Uh, for example, you, uh, can I can I take you home after class? Okay, that is also an offer. Okay, can I bring you some coffee? Can I bring you some milk? Can I bring you something from the supermarket? Offering help. Okay. Can I help you with your English classes? Okay. Good. And the last, uh, the last one here is the negative, right? You cannot smoke in this room. Not allowed. Okay. You cannot miss classes any day. Okay. You are not permitted. Okay. So you can't go to party. Okay. No permission to go to party. Okay. 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 All right. So here we have. Out. Okay, and then uh, for tomorrow we have. Okay, can and should order to questions. This is what we were checking today. Just let's listen to this and then we, we're almost done, okay? Now listen. You have already listened to a conversation where can and should were introduced. Those are called moral words. Moral words, attitude or mood. We can also use them to ask for and give advice. Stay with us as we will explain them. Modal verb, can and should. What can I do in Mexico City? You can see the Palace of Fine Arts. Mondays. What should I see there? You should visit the National Museum. You shouldn't miss the Pyramid of the Sun. Okay, we'll talk about the modal verbs can and should. This is how we use it in a question. Subject question word plus modal verb plus subject plus verb plus question mark. Okay, that is the structure, right? Important. Okay, WH word, where should we go? You can use what? What should we do? You can use why. Why should we pay for that? Okay, here you can use what, where, who. Who should, who should I visit tomorrow? Who should I ask the next question? Okay, so you can use all the different WH words. Where should we go? And this is how we use it in a positive sentence. Subject plus modal verb plus verb plus complement. We should go to a museum. This is how we use it in a negative sentence. Subject plus modal verb plus not plus verb plus complement. We shouldn't go to a museum. It is important to notice that models do not take a final S and neither oh, does the S. Okay, this is important and this is what I mentioned, right? When you use he, you don't say he should. Go. No, he should go. Okay, should she go. should go. We should go. So here we only change I, you, he, she, it, we, you, they, and then the rest is the same. Okay, okay. I should go. We should go. She should go. He should go. They should go. Okay, if it is a dog, an animal, it should go. Okay. It's not necessary. In negative, Mary shouldn't drink. Okay, Jose shouldn't drink. Uh, the dog shouldn't drink. Okay, so then if you see, no third person. No, he, she, is. Okay. 
Okay. Good. Okay. Sir, he should go to a museum. Maria shouldn't. You notice there's no change on should and neither on the main verb go. All right. Okay, then for tomorrow, don't forget, well, to start, you know, working on the knowledge checks. If you have questions, let me know. Okay, you have to this. And tomorrow we will have the pronunciation of can't and shouldn't to practice. And then we have another topic. Okay, everyone. Okay. It was a pleasure to be with you again today. So have a very good night. And I will see you tomorrow. Okay. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Bye. 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 B